Hello. Bruno, where are we at today? Today we're at Disney Springs, aka Downtown Disney, aka Pleasure Island. And we're here to why? We're gonna eat at Deluxe Burger and check out the Bakery. Yep. So, and do a little bit of walking around because we haven't been, I feel like Anna from Frozen for the first time in forever. forever. We haven't so, been here in a long time. No, we have not. So yeah, we're going to eat at Deluxe Burger really quickly. And yep. then we're going to go to the Gluten Free yep. Bakery, Aaron McKenna's as well. Yep, and then maybe walk around, check for who knows why. I know, just enjoy. Just enjoy it's the, uh, it's a beautiful day out. I know our last video we said it was beautiful and it, that is continuing mm -hmm. till today. It is beautiful out. So we're going to head into Deluxe, Deluxe Burger and um, get some food. That's right. All right. So we've gotten our food from Deluxe Burger. So we ended up coming inside the restaurant and talking to a chef just because- Chef had, Jose. Chef Jose. Yep. You can do mobile order here, but because of Brandon's special dietary needs, uh, we had some questions. We wanted to make sure we talked to a chef, so you can do that too. Um, chef Jose was great. I ended up getting the Southern Barbecue Burger, which can be modified to be gluten-free on a gluten-free bun. Um, there good. are some dairy-free options here. Um, of course, a regular burger. They can do some of the specialty burgers modified, and then they also have a plant-based vegan burger, which is also gluten-free and dairy-free. So I almost got that. It sounds good. But we haven't been here in a year. Yeah, so we haven't been here in well over a year because it was before the pandemic started. So um, yeah, excited. We got fries. We were gonna order our own orders, and then the chef yep. said, "Why don't you split them?" But then they didn't split them up for us and like put it in a box that we could share. So these are so mine. We have a spot for Brandon, and then yeah, we got. They've changed out some of the sauces. The chipotle mayo used to have dairy in it, but it's now gluten free and dairy free. And then this one does have dairy, but this is gluten free. This is the uh, garlic ranch. So yeah, I'm excited to dig in. All right. And oh, by the way, before I do, I'm going to pan over. Most people are eating outside and we expected to fully eat outside, but we are allowed to eat in the back room. I confirmed it. I did yeah, talk to a cast member. There's no one in here. There's literally That's no one in here. the only reason we're in here right Yeah. Now. We intended to eat outside, but there is literally no one in here. So ready to dig in? Mm -hmm. All right. I got the um, regular cheeseburger on a non-gluten-free bun, of course, but it is safe for um, fish, shellfish, peanuts, turkey, and chicken. So um, Chef Jose was outstanding, and it looks it looks good. It looks really good. And I, uh, as Sarah said, my fries are ready to divide. You know what? Good fries, deluxe burger fries. They're, um, there's a strong flavor. I'm gonna let Sarah describe the flavor because everyone knows I'm bad at describing flavors. But um, good fries, and I will bite into my burger in a second. All right, so I'm eating my first bite, as you can see. Really good. Deluxe has some really, really good hamburgers. Um, like It's not a gourmet burger or anything like that, but really good. Really nice char to it. You can probably see it right there, actually. Uh, really nice char. Um, yeah, Deluxe burgers are absolutely delicious. They always have been. Me and Sarah think they're very solid and affordable for Disney, so very good. Quick fry, fry here, uh, actually. And I'd like Sarah to describe how the flavor. There's that, what's that flavor to it? I can't They're describe. hand-cut fries. Yep. So, I think they soak them in something like overnight, and then. Is there a vinegar flavor to it? There's no, no vinegar. Never mind. But they do soak them. That is, but these would be great with vinegar on them. Maybe that. Maybe um, <laughs> back in the day. But yeah, they're really good. Um, I do like that they're made in a dedicated fryer, so they're safe for both of us. I am gonna try, I love this oh, chipotle yeah. mayo. Yeah, these are made in a dedicated fryer, mm -hmm. so. 
And you just had Chipotle? Uh huh. Oh, oh. Uh oh, let's get her face. Get her reaction. And? That's extra Chipotle. Holy moly, I'm gonna have some water for you, Sam. And yeah, that's good. Okay, cool. And then I'm gonna try the ranch really quick. Um, this does have dairy, so I'm not gonna do too much of this throughout my meal, but I just yep. wanna taste it just because I've never had it before. Oh, mm -hmm. good. If you like ranch, I think this is a great option. Okay. It definitely is very garlicky, but the winner, of course, for me, if you like spicy food, is always gonna be the chipotle yep. mayo. I'm very sad. Yeah, they got rid of the curry ketchup. Yeah, they, they did, yep. They don't have honey mustard anymore either, which I also love their honey mustard yep. here. So, okay. sad days, but they still have my chipotle cool. meal, so I'm happy about that. Nice meal. Mm -hmm. All right, Sarah's about to eat her burger, and they're probably the same burgers, but look how monstrous this thing looks. Well, because I have more toppings on it. That's true. Yeah. That looks really, really good. So, so I have the barbecue burger. Um, it has smoked Gouda on it, bacon, and barbecue sauce. They do have a new barbecue sauce here, which contains gluten because it has stout in it. But this barbecue sauce does not. I confirmed that in two different kinds. So um, I'm going to take a bite. It's going to be messy, so we might do a bite and then show you the reaction afterwards. Yeah, Sarah's going to take a bite. So the burger is good as always. <laughs> really good. I'm glad I went with this. I did really want to try the plant-based burger, but again, it's been over a year since we've been here, so I really wanted to get their burger. The burgers are great here. Um, bacon's great. The barbecue sauce is generic. It's nothing too exciting. I like the smoked Gouda, um, but just solid. And the gluten-free bun is Bloomfield Farms, okay. which I really like. Um, I remember the first time I had it here, I was like, is this gluten-free? Are we sure about this? Okay. Uh, it's so good. So yeah. And, solid, and I'm gonna keep digging. And in. really quick, I'm gonna ask a question. You said there is a uh, plant-based burger here? There is a plant-based burger okay. here. They use Beyond Burger or Beyond okay. Meat here. Um, so it's gluten-free and of course dairy-free and vegan. And it has a mango salsa on it. And one day I'm going to try it. But yes. <laughs> this burger called my name today. All right, right. Let's, uh, we're gonna enjoy this and we'll debrief in a little bit. So we, we just got done eating, really good. Food. We'll do a debrief in a little bit, but we are on our way to Aaron McKenna's. Yeah, that one. Oh, we're on our way to Aaron, we're going over here. Yeah, the gluten-free bakery. We're going to the uh, Aaron McKenna's gluten-free bakery now. We did. We uh, just we just got done at Aaron McKenna's Bakery, which is a hundred percent, a one hundred percent gluten free bakery. And um, we can't get out what we really got here, but Sarah, maybe from home, will insert uh -huh. footage. We got. I'm gonna list off what we got, okay. and I'll show some photos. Okay. Uh, we got a salted brownie bar. We got lemon tea cake because I love that. Uh, a Samoa donut, also a big favorite of mine. A frosted sugar cookie. This is. It's two cookies in one. It's his best friends on it. I think Brandon showed some of that photo of that which is super cute and then we got a brownie bomb cupcake that just looks like chocolate 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 a brownie bomb it looks awesome it's the bomb it might be the bomb it might be the bomb so um yeah we'll get footage at home because it's all in the back here but uh yeah 
Yeah, there we go. Stuff. Yeah, lots of stuff in that bag. So uh, very easy experience. Went in there, one group at a time. Yeah. Uh, no issues. Uh, got in, got out. Very cool. So. Yeah. Uh, and they were pretty well stocked right yeah. now. Yeah. So. Awesome. Good. We're now walking to specifically look for a new limited edition match band from, from WandaVision. There is a new WandaVision limited edition band, and like everyone else, we love WandaVision. Of course. And uh, we can link to the video, but I do have a lot of limited edition bands. So uh, hopefully they will have it, but that is what we're looking for. Yeah. On our way to the Marvel store now because the pin traders did not have the magic band. No, but they said maybe over here. So yeah. we're gonna get our steps in. Yeah, we're getting our steps in. We are walking off the lunch. Um and hope come on Marvel store. If not, then then no magic band. I'm not well, maybe. Maybe. We're, we're gonna find it one day. WandaVision limited edition magic band. All right, so we just got done at the Marvel store. No magic band. No magic band, but we but got to see Groot. Baby Groot. Baby Groot. Sitting on a shoulder. And Baby Groot also did not get the magic band. Yeah. We got to hear the tale of how he tried to wait for one and yeah. he couldn't get it. Cast member name, I think his name was Ernie, was phenomenal. He was telling us Baby Groot's story of trying to obtain the limited edition the WandaVision trials, magic band. The trials and tribulations yes, of Baby Groot. Groot. So we are, we're down by the water right now, and we're about to uh, find a seat to debrief mm -hmm. and uh, tell you guys what we thought of our a couple hours out here. Yeah. Okay. All right, so we're wrapping up our yep. little quick couple hour visit to Disney Springs. Yeah, we were only here a few hours. Um, did get our steps in though. We sure did. So we started at Deluxe Burger. We did, which was great. Yeah, it was really good. Chef Jose was outstanding. Yeah, um, and I think if you have special dietary needs, it's a great option for quick service. If you like burgers and fries, yeah. um, I do recommend if you have special dietary needs to go into the restaurant and talk to your chef. Yes, yes, and uh, we were allowed to go in. They opened the door for us, and we went to the side and spoke to the chef. Mm -hmm. Otherwise, right. they want you to do mostly mobile order. Yeah. And you can mobile order some special mm -hmm. dietary needs, but if you have things that are multiple special diets yep. or something that's not listed on the top eight, it's a good idea to go talk to a chef. Yeah, and uh, he was really... Uh, kind with his time and everything and uh you saw what we ordered uh mine was really good my uh just cheeseburger mm -hmm. and sarah had the more messy i did i had a barbecue burger which yep. was really good yeah um i've had a version of that before without cheese on it that was dairy free so if you're dairy free that might be an option for you to, again talk to a chef and ingredients do change so we yep. did learn that they do not have sa sauces that they usually have yeah. here so that's why it's always good to talk to a chef but yep. yeah the burger was good the fries, I'm going to say the fries are good. They're not as good as they used no, to be for, when they first opened. Yeah, we've talked about this at length with each other before and other, other our friends. Mm -hmm. When this place, for, when Deluxe Burger first opened, the fries were the oh, word right. legit. Whatever you want to use, mind they blowing. were mind-blowingly delicious <laughs> fries. And then something happened. We don't know what, but something... They're still good. They're, they're still good. good. They're not as good. I, I'm not good with describing flavor, as I've said like three times in this video now. But something changed in them, and everyone agreed on it. Like, not just me and Sarah, by any means. Yeah, everyone agreed. They're not as crisp, and mm -hmm. sometimes they they feel a little stale. Yeah. Not, so. That's not the right word, but hopefully that's kind of yeah. gets the intent of what it, yeah. it is. But, yeah, overall it was good. Yep. Great quick service option. Yeah. Um, yeah, that was, I think, easy peasy. All right, and then we moved on to Aaron McKenna's Bakery. Yes, which is a dangerous place for me to go. <laughs> it is, it is. <laughs> um, we could... Uh, she kept saying, we want this, 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 this. And I thought, okay, that's, oh, no, this, this, this. 
Yeah. It, was, it was great. Yeah, so she loves it. Yeah. I love it too, but Sarah it's really loves it. I tried to get some of those things that I like that are kind of my staple favorites um, because sometimes consistency is a challenge at your returners with some of the newer items, but I always get lemon tea cake and some other things, so I got that. Um, so super excited to try a couple of new items as well as some favorites. And then we tried to go get your magic band. We tried to do a magic band journey, went to uh, Pen Traders and the Marvel store. Nothing uh, sold out. Um, is it actually sold out? We, we're going to try some other stores in the future at the parks, maybe, or something like that. Because sometimes they'll tell you bands are sold out and they're not. Um, yep. But yeah, so we're going to keep checking. If this ends up being an eBay band, it is what it is, maybe. <laughs> um, yeah, but, you haven't eBay too many. Bands no, I've only had to eBay like two bands in my yeah. in my life. In my life, like I've been doing this forever <laughs> um, <laughs> since they started. But uh, but yeah, so uh, we struck out on the magic bands. But it's okay. We got our steps in. It's a gorgeous day out, as you can yeah. you can all see. Super nice. Mm -hmm. All right, so we had a quick cut because um, we are surrounded by crows or ravens, whatever they are. Oh, yeah, crows. Crows, yeah, crows, but quoth the raven. We're going to pretend they're ravens. Um, but yeah, they're around us. I took some video. Maybe we'll insert footage, maybe not. But we got ravens, crows all around They smell our food. gluten-based yep. goods. The birds are telling. They, we're literally okay. surrounded. Okay, hold on. I, oh, my gosh. You, everyone knows I hate to do this. I'm taking us off video for a second. I don't Uh, I don't... Did you even think about my cupcakes? Okay, we're back. <laughs> we are surrounded by... I think they're waiting for us to give them something. Yeah, we are not. <laughs> so, right. so to wrap it up, uh, great, great time at Disney Springs. Yeah, oh, quickly, uh, social distancing crowds, uh, we oh, came yeah. during the week. Mm -hmm. uh, we both had time off, so we came during the week at like 2.30 in the afternoon. So it's quieter than it has been on uh, the last visit we yep. came, it was much busier. So I think the weekday during the day seems to be a good time. Good time to go. It's still yeah. busy though. Yeah, don't, yeah, it, it, there are people here, as you've seen in some of the footage, but a lot less crowded than yeah, so if you are going to Disney Springs, just something to think about if yeah. you don't want to have high crowds because it does seem like yeah. Disney Springs seems to be very, very popular. Yes. Yeah. So, uh, but with that, thank you to all the patrons on Patreon. You're all awesome. Thank you to everyone that likes, subscribes, hits the bell. Give us a thumbs up if you want. Um, also, please leave a comment if you yeah. feel like what you saw. If you have any questions for us, uh, Sarah's really good at responding to everything. And, uh, you know, have, have you been out here lately? You think we're gonna make it out okay? Are we gonna make it out alive? <laughs> Are we gonna get these cupcakes home or yeah, not? So, Boom. so we're gonna cut this now. <laughs> but thank you for watching. Everyone's awesome. Yeah. Uh, like I said, uh, we'll be back in our next video. But we are. I wish you. Everyone, we're turning into the horror movie, The Birds. Yeah, this is The Birds. <laughs> um, so Alfred Hitchcock, so we're thinking of you. All right. Have a good day. Bye. Bye. <laughs>